Driving on sidewalks, running red lights, going the wrong way down a one way. These are just some of the complaints against DoorDash drivers in Boston alone. Now DoorDash is taking action at the urging of Boston city officials. The company pledging to crack down on dangerous delivery drivers and kick them off its platform. DoorDash says the effort will start in Boston, but may expand to other cities. The delivery app also says it will update its vehicle registration requirements. Officials in Boston and New York have said many dashers are using unregistered vehicles and sharing accounts, leading to unsafe and unauthorized drivers behind the wheel. New York authorities have seized 13,000 scooters and mopeds that were unregistered or used to break laws so far this year. DoorDash now says it will require drivers to more frequently submit real-time selfies to prove their identities while out for delivery, particularly if it discovers signs of account sharing. Dashers will be removed if they fail to confirm their identities. But critics note DoorDash's algorithm that docks employees for tardiness and rewards them for speed of delivery may be partly to blame for unsafe driving habits. One bad review can reportedly limit a dasher's delivery opportunities. This downward pressure is a big part of why you might see delivery workers speeding or going the wrong way down a street on their bike. The clear incentive is to make as many orders as you can, as quickly as you can, even if that means compromising safety. DoorDash's announcement also comes after another disturbing incident in late June. Authorities in Utah say a dasher using other people's accounts defecated in a woman's drink. After review of security footage, police confirmed the customer's suspicions. The dasher was arrested after being pulled over for a traffic violation while out for another delivery. An affidavit revealed the suspect did not have a local ID, only an employment authorization document. And in Southern California, a dasher was caught on camera using an apartment lobby trash can as a toilet in 2021. DoorDash said she is no longer able to deliver for the company, but did not disclose the private investigation. For more stories like this, download the Straight Arrow News app or visit our website at san.com.